Hey guys, it's Useless Minion here, back, hopefully, if this works. Um, obviously, what you can see I got is the Scar Predator Mask from AVP1, or AVP for the people that want to get really technical. Um, this is another sideshow piece. Um, I've got to say, I am well impressed with this. Made out of the same stuff as the, uh, the Wolf Mask. Um, I think, I'm sure it's fiberglass or something like that. The base is the... If I can work out, me Mrs. has got a new camera, and it's not zooming. Um, yep, yeah, the base is the same, and it's the heaviest part of it. I think it's like, I don't know if it's polystone or something, but it weighs a ton anyway. It's obviously the same, it's got the, the bit where your magnet fits on the helmet and it goes in the that part so you can have it sitting up like that or you can mount it to the wall and you can pop it on there so it looks like how nicely that is propped onto the wall Ooh. There you go. magnets super powerful detail in it is really good it's all smooth and it's got obviously a little bit of detailing around there you've got the symbol of the clan that the Scar Predator belongs to. That's all like it's been cut out if you know what I mean. So obviously when he's put it in acid with the um face hugger's finger, it's like it's depressed in. Looks looks pretty cool the effect on it to be fair. He's also got the side port with the wires going up. That's all, it's all one piece. It's not like a separate little spring wire or something like that. And it's got the well, it's got three holes, but normally I think they only have two wires that they, they um, pop off and then they can take the helmet off or something like that. Anyway, on the Hot Toys figures, they've only got two wires. It's also got some sort of circle hex key thing there. I don't know what the hell that's for. Uh, he's got nothing on there except for his laser target in the sensor. And again with the wolf button under there and the light comes on um, there's not much more to this figure to be fair I, I do prefer the wolf um, bio helmet to this one just for the sheer amount of detail that it's got on it but to be fair this one's pretty cool I'm quite looking forward to the um, Celtic mask and I've also seen on play.com they've got the Predator 2 mask but being so it's not even out on Sideshow um, toy.com or whatever it's called. I don't know how they're going to sell that if it comes through Sideshow and Sideshow I haven't even got it on their website. I'm quite um, interested in this, the um, sword that they've got. That looks pretty smart. So uh, that might be a future purchase. Also, one downfall, and it, I think it is a big downfall for this awesome mask, is on the wolf one, on the eye sockets, it had like plastic all through it but then it had like wire mesh like real wire mesh in it so it would give the the eye hole you know a really good effect this one it's like side has gone cheap it looks all right from probably what i'm showing you and it looks all right to be fair it's not that bad but it's all plastic or it's probably not even plastic it looks like it's cardboard with a wire mesh sticker on it so I was pretty disappointed with Sideshow's effort on being a cheapskate there. They make good stuff, don't get me wrong, but this, you know, I thought this was like a pretty lame attempt at it. Compared to the other one anyway. That's my point of view. Feel free to comment and probably don't bollock me for this or whatever, but <clears throat> ignore that. That is not mine. I swear. Anyway, I hope this video works, because if it does, I'll obviously be able to upload a load more videos. Um, thanks for watching. Please subscribe. You don't have to, but, you know, whatever. And, um, yeah, that's it. See you.